Hi. Uh, to create something like this, I used one of my ice soda bottles. They're really smooth, really easy to work with. Oops, I need a bottle. Hold on. All right. So I made these after I had already cut off the top. For the ones that I have on here, I left the top on. I cut off the bottom and that left that little curved. You can do that. You can do this two different ways. Here's how I made these. I just cut them out of the bottle. I don't cut the bottom off for this one. For these right here. I left the bottom on. Cut the pet the leaves out, sorry. To make the holes. Let's see. This shows up. Come on. All right. This is not how you want your holes to be. I don't know if you, how well you can see that clearly. But if I strictly just make the holes using this, it could like rip the plastic, tear the plastic, you know. Not how you want to do. I kind of make pre-drilled holes using a box cutter. I go into it and I just go like this, make a very tiny hole, make sure it goes through, and then I get this out and I poke it through. So that's this thickness, which just happens to be the same thickness as the um, the shish kebab stick, bamboo shish kebab stick. So, and then I slide this through the holes. You can glue them on, paint them, and you're done. Very easy, very quick. You can make plenty of these in just one day alone compared to doing flowers, which takes days. And if you want to take a guess at to what that will be, go ahead and comment below. See what you think that's going to be. My kids are already excited about it. The leaves are going to take probably the longest time because I have to attach. Um, well, they're going to be bigger leaves than these. So I need more liter bottles to do the leaves. And that's kind of what I'm doing lately.